Major didn't do that, but okay. All right. All right. All right. Look, just tell me what happened, brother. I don't know. Well, where's she at? I need you. I'm asking you for your help. I'm a detective, and I'm asking you for your help. Okay. I'm asking you for help. I need your help. Can you help me? I don't know. You don't know if you can help me? Yes. I need your help. Help me out. Tell me what to do. Has anybody asked you for help today? I need your help. I'm asking you as a friend for help. Can you help me? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? You can't help a friend out? I don't know what you need. I need to know where Lauren's at. I don't know. When's the last time you seen her? Two or three weeks ago. Has anybody, have you ever seen anybody over at her house the last couple nights? No. Okay. If you knew where she was, would you tell me? Yes. What do you think happened to her? I don't know. Do you even care? I mean, I don't know, do you? Yes. Do you have a girlfriend? No. Did you think Lauren was your girlfriend? No. You said you didn't have any other cars, right? Right. Well, why would you, everybody you went to school with for the last three and four years said that you own another car other than that Geo Prism? Everybody I talked to, all your friends you were in school with, 
people that you worked at the district attorney's office with said you have other cars other than that car. And you're going to sit here today and tell me you don't have another car? I don't. Well, where's it at? I don't have one. You never had another car besides that jail prison? No. So if I call your granddaddy, he's going to tell me that you only have one car? Yes. What's his phone number? I don't know. Yeah, you do, because I already have his phone number. You don't know his phone number? No. Hmm? seriously can't help us out. His number's in my cell phone. Where's the mess to start? Where's your cell phone? At the apartment. In your apartment? I mean, it's kind of late to be calling him. Does he stay up late? I don't know. Do you have a grandmother or is it just him? My grandmother passed away. A while back? Yes. But you're close to your grandfather, right? Yes. Don't he own some property or something, he said? A couple of acres? My granddaddy or my grandfather. Who it's lives my, in Pike County? My granddaddy. Does he own any land down there? Yes. Okay. And do sometimes you go down there to visit him or something? Last time we met, I went down and visited with my aunt and uncle. Okay. What did he do for a living? Was he an attorney like you're... He worked for the Southern Railroad Company. Is anybody in your family an attorney? No. You're the only one that went through law school? Yes. Well, that's an accomplishment, don't you think? Yes. I mean, it took a long time, right? Yes. A lot of, a lot of studying. You, I think you told me earlier you were from up Atlanta or... <clears throat> Did you live in Atlanta or Griffin or something like that? Lilburn. Do you don't have any family left up there? Yes. Well, who lives up there? My parents. Okay. Any brothers or sisters? My sister lives in Tucker. Georgia? Yes. What's up with the pair of underwear that was in your apartment? It was know. like a mask. It was cut out like a mask. Do you, you cut underwear out that looked like a mask? No. How many guns did you have in your apartment? Three. What are they? Do you know what they are? A rifle. What kind of rifle did you have? An AK semi-automatic. Where'd you buy it from? Classic Arms. Is that Atlanta or something? Online. Okay. What kind of pistols do you own? EAA Witness. Full size and compact. Okay. What is that? What about the one that was on the bed? That's the full size. That's the full size one. Where's the? What was the other one? The compact. Where was that at? On the table by the bed. Oh, yeah. Remember I was in there. Mm-hmm. Then you had that samurai sword. Yes. That's just a. I mean, that's not. Ex is it expensive sword or is it just a no. knockoff? It's just one of the knockoff swords. Yes. And what about the knife? Which knife? The big the one that was, remember you showed me it was dull? Yes. What kind of knife is that? Because I don't know. Kukri. I don't know where you get something like that online. I bought it from a friend. Did you have any other knives in the house? Yes. That I didn't see? Because you, you didn't show me no other knives. That's the only one you showed me. What other knives did I miss? There's a pocket knife that's on the table. Are you a knife collector or a knife person? or? No. You just like knives? I used to collect swords. I mean, do you know your swords? Yes. I mean, to sell and trade swords? No. But you just bought here and there? Yes. But you wouldn't consider yourself like a sword expert? No. Okay. Because, you know, they have that TV show where they sell stuff, you know, at night yes. on TV. With, I don't know what it's called, the knife shop or something like that. Have you ever seen what I'm talking about? I don't know if yes. you have cable TV or not. All right. Ooh, you know, tonight, we're still looking for Lauren. You know any of these other girls in this picture? I know the 
she goes to law school. I okay. can't remember her name. So she's studying to be an attorney too? Yes. Okay. Is that how Lauren looked with the long hair the last time you seen her? Yes. Or she got, that's how she looks? Yes. of this. I know you're smarter, okay? I know you have an observation you can tell me. What's What do you think happened to her? I think someone took her. You think, uh, I mean, you watch TV shows, right? Like yes. the Taker show. What's your observation? How do you think somebody would take her? If somebody did take her. When she was running. Does she normally run all the time? She runs, I don't know how often. You mean you think somebody might have took her when she was running like down the street somewhere? Yes. You don't think somebody got her when she got back to her apartment? I don't know. Well, you know there was a body found in the trash can next to the apartments. Yes. You do know that. And it's a female, white female's body. Right there. Right next to y'all's apartment. Feet within from her apartment. Scared, are you? No. Are you 
sad that something happened to Lauren, that that's her in that trash can? Yes. When's the last time you, you said you can't remember the last time earlier today that you took the trash out to the trash can? Right? Am I wrong? That's right. I mean, because you said you like stayed inside the whole the whole weekend, I think, because you had all your food and all that. You never went to Kroger over the weekend or Walmart or anything? I don't remember. But you could have. I don't know. When you go to Kroger, when you do go to the store and get your food, do you use a credit card or you pay cash? Cash. Do you have a Kroger card? Yes. Okay. So the Kroger card should be able to tell if you were at Kroger this week, you right? Yes. Did you swipe your card or just enter your cell phone number? They scan it. Oh, because I ain't on my phone number because I can't never remember bringing the card. But you don't remember if you went over to bank. You drive your car or do you walk over there? I drive. You ever go to Walmart on the East Town or Gray Highway? Or which Walmart do you go to when you go to Walmart? Gray Highway. You don't ever go out to Zeppelin Road? I don't think so. You never been out there? You know where Zeppelin Road, the new Walmart? No. You don't? So you just basically go to Walmart right away? Yes. Okay. Do you know where you're at tonight? Yes. Where are you at? Detective Bureau. Okay. And you know why we've been working all day trying to find Lauren, right? Yes. Because her family wants to know where she's at. Yes. And I don't know what to tell her family. So I'm asking you, what do I need to tell her family? I don't know. <laughs> what do you want me to tell them? I don't know. Huh? You're going to have to tell me what to tell her family. It's all on you, brother. What do you want me to tell her family? Huh? I don't know. Well, I need to know. I need to know. Okay. If something happened to Lauren and you know, you need to tell me. If you know something. Because I need to know. Because her family's down here want to know what happened to her. I don't know. You don't know? No. That's what you want me to tell her mother and her father. That you don't know. I don't know. Not that you're sorry that she's missing. Not that you've been trying to help me all day find her. But you just wanted me to tell her I don't know. I don't know. Are you a sorry either. piece of shit that you want me to tell her that? You got your ass on that fucking news and stood out there and gave a media report that her mother saw about her missing daughter. And you want me to sit there and tell them that you don't know. Is that what you want me to tell them? Because you're all over the news. You sure stood out there and ran your mouth to the news media. But now you're going to get out here and you don't fucking know. You know. You're just a sorry piece of shit that don't give a fuck. Right? No. Well, why'd you tell the media everything? Do you need to see what you told the media today? Yes. It was on the 11 o'clock news. Well, I'm asking you. Tell me. I want to know. I don't know where she is. That ain't what you told the media. You didn't stand in front of that camera and say, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Right? You buy all these weapons. Was you ever in the military? No. 
What do you need all these weapons for? Are you scared somebody's going to hurt you? No. What do you need all these weapons for? To have. Why? There's a reason why. Were you molested as a child? No. Then why do you need all these weapons? To have. Why? Give me one good reason. Just give me one reason. To have. Why? Does it make you feel important? No. Hmm? Are you a big guy because you got a weapon? No. Do you even know how to use it? Yes. I need you to tell me what you want me to tell her mother. And then I won't ask you another thing. I'm not going to tell her mother that you don't know. Because her mother saw you on the news tonight. And she cried all the way down to Macon. Because you had the balls to get on the news and tell everybody everything. You didn't have no problem talking to the news when they asked you questions. I'm asking you questions. Where's Lauren? I don't know. Yes, you do know. You do know. You do know. You know. You know. You do know. And everybody in Macon knows you knows because you got your sorry ass on the news and told everybody. So every friend you have in Macon knows that you know. Everybody you go to school with, every one of your professors, everybody knows that you know. Because you got on the news tonight and told everybody that you know. Now how do you think? Hmm? You think you'll be walking down the street tomorrow and nobody bother you? Hmm? Think nobody's going to come over and knock on the door to see if you want to talk to me again? I don't know. Oh, they're going to be over there, brother. So this little act that you're doing right now ain't working with me. Okay? Because you didn't have no problem talking to the media. No problem. So you just to snap out of it and tell me what the hell happened. So we can move on. I don't know. Well, how many times you going to say I don't know? How you gonna say it? What are you gonna say? I remember. I don't want to remember what happened to her. Hmm? How many times you gonna say that? If you did something that you regret, you need to let me know. I didn't. Well, who did? was found over here, right next to where you live. And what do you have in your apartment? A lot of knives. A lot of guns. Right? Yes. And I'm asking you about it, and you're just saying, I don't know. That's, all, that's the only answer you can give is I don't know. But six hours or a couple hours ago, you was out there telling the media everything. You didn't stand in front of that camera and say, I don't know. You were actually answering questions. Right? How many interviews did you give? Three? I don't know. <laughs> you gave like three. Do you think that was a proper thing to do? When a mother's looking for her child? They asked me what happened. And what did you tell them? What did you tell them? That Lauren was missing. Okay. What else did you tell them? That we had gone looking for her. Okay. And what? And that we hadn't found her. And what else did they ask you? I don't remember. Why don't you remember? I don't. You're 
telling me that you went through long.